All right, welcome back to part three of the West Edmonton Mall tour. Kind of changed my mind about Bourbon Street here. I'm gonna come back to that later on. And uh, I'll probably have something to eat while I'm in there. Another spot to get your phone accessory stuff at. There's lots of those around. Shoes and handbags. Ooh, 40% off. Yay. It's called Aldo. Let's see if I can't manage to get some wide angle going on here again. Moving on over this way. Come on, turn around. No other way. Face up. <sighs> Cross the way. Bath and body works. All kinds of soap and stuff. Oh, hey. Check that out. Another little water feature. Kind of neat. I like this stuff. Uh, neat little colored lights and everything. Looks like they aren't all going though, but yeah, whatever. Underneath the cover there's a 2018 Ferrari that you can enter to win. Ticket prices and all that other stuff. And more water feature over here. I like this stuff. I'd be happier if it was all working. Oh, hey. I just realized I'm almost at the halfway mark here. Oh, almost time to mosey on upstairs. Show you the other half of the mall once we get there. But and I guess this place is slated to open up around 11 o'clock. That's about 15, 20 minutes from now. So we'll see what happens when that happens. And I want to come back to this store because I think I want to get myself a different type of face mask. And we're coming up on the other food mart or food court. This place is a lot bigger than the other one. And again, most everything is all closed. There's the... Uh, Taco time over there, hit the button. Push over, hit the button there, go taco time, yay. I think I'll stay in close mode like this for a bit. Just see all the different restaurants and stuff. Oh, ah. Uh, green, okay, that's not gonna work. How about one? Opa, Greece. Gangnam Korean street food. I don't know about that. Splash Poke. I have no idea what this store is about. Fat Burger. The name is self explanatory. <laughs> All right. I bought glasses here before. Actually, maybe probably the ones I'm wearing right now. They're my, uh, they're my safety work glasses. And uh, all my other ones I've either killed or generally just dismembered in one form or another. Uh, little video game arcade store. Kind of neat. See if I can get the name in there. Let me go back to wide angle again. 5D Extreme Attractions. 
Yeah, I can't say I've ever been there. Spot for call of nature all buried away down there. Another stuff. New play. I'm not sure what this new play is yet. Maybe another. Oh, no. Some. Oh, yeah, it's one of those get tickets and stuff and win prizes. All right. Feshy. Oops. Feshny. Delicious foe. I actually like that place. Pizza and Donair. Tokyo Express. Subway. Bourbon Street Grill. We'll be getting back to Bourbon Street in a little while. KFC. I think you get the general idea. It's a food court. Huh. Okay, I'm gonna have to double back in a little bit here. Is uh, there's actually something I want to approach from a certain angle. But I am gonna come up over here a little bit. Because over here in the middle of the, uh, the walkway here, Now, this is part, whoops, if I can do that. This is part of a mini golf course. Just over here, kind of semi sort of mini golf. Yay! <laughs> oh, hey, lockers. Uh, no idea how much they're going to cost. Oh, but they're only, only available by request. Oh well, guess I'm still stuck carrying my helmet around. Ooh, place you can get your sunglass on at. But when I come back around again, I'll uh, I'll give you the other side view here in a minute. There's a big pillar in the way. Lots of little kitty hearts hanging out around. Another few different looks here. Kind of neat. Something to amuse the kids, no matter how old you are. Because mini golf is mini golf. It's just fun. Okay, we'll get around over here. London Drugs. That's actually where I picked up this gimbal at. I like it. I just got to figure out how to actually get it to work properly. But yeah, London Drugs. Hey. All right, walk around, oh, glass elevator. You don't have to worry too much about being scared of heights because it only goes up one floor. So that's all good. Oops. All your little social distancing stuff going on. Oops, I should have been paying a bit more attention here as I was coming around. Turn that way. Turn that way, thank you. Yeah. Kind of neat, one of the little attractions in the mall here. Shiny brass rail. Not at the moment, but at almost any given time, you can see attendants coming around and cleaning up the glass and the rails here. We do it on a pretty regular basis.
Uh, I'm almost starting to regret coming here this early. I am, I am. I'm tired and getting hungry. Okay. Get around over here, whoops. One thing I like about these places compared to other ones, there's like little waste disposal places all over everywhere. It's kind of good. All right, what's down this way? Uh, an entrance. Okay, well, we'll look around there. It doesn't. I know there's some other stuff down there, but we're going to take the long way around to go see that. Wait a minute. What's that say? It's the other way. Professor West Edmonton Mall's original fog detector. That's kind of, I should come over here and get a look at that. That's, I think that's kind of humorous, but anyways, down a little bit. There we go, alrighty. Okay, now this is supposed to be connected, so I should be able to pull that, and no, it doesn't. All right, well, we're gonna cheat a little bit, cross over the little bridge. Long walk so far. Not too sure how many steps I've put in, but it's been a lot. So we're just gonna scoot through here real quick. Other places. Dairy Queen, I like Dairy Queen sometimes. Szechuan, Walk Box. Another Greek semi sort of place, Jimmy the Greek, sort of like Opa's. New Asian Village. New York Fries. You like that sort of thing. Swiss Shelley and Harvey's, yeah, they merged a whole bunch ago, a while ago, so they're the same store. Edo, little Japanese place. Calais, Mexico. I might have to come back here and try that too. Crepe works if you're into crepes. Oriental Delight. They got all their food out. Well, not all of it yet, but it's all nice there, untouched, looking nice and yummy. At some point or another anyways. Uh, there's the taco time again. Yeah. I was, uh, I just had some food there the other day. All right. Now, this is kind of something I was semi sort of wanting to talk about. Way back. Well, I know you're just looking at a big puddle of water, but way back when Edmonton Mall, or West Edmonton Mall first opened, there used to be a submarine ride here. It was pretty cool. They'd stick eight or 10 of you in a little submarine, splash you underwater, and you'd go run a circuit under the bridge and everything. Oh, hey, cool. I just noticed that little peacock sidetrack. That's kind of neat. Okay. So anyways, uh, the submarine had come all around along here. That's kind of neat. I like that. I want to get in a little closer on the face here. Oops, come on. Up, 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 up. 
up the open part. There we go. That's kind of neat, I think, anyways. But yeah, so go all around here. Over there. Over here is Sea Lions Rock. If I'm still here at around two o'clock, I'll actually uh, do the show there and uh, and post that up as well. So, anyways, the submarine had come along here. I don't know if you can see it or not. But there's a little monorail it rode on, and it would come around. Oops, there's the mirror. Hey. And it would actually come up to this life-size replica of the Santa Maria. This is a life-size replica. Bye everybody, still stuck carrying my helmet. So for any of you history buffs out there who actually know what ship the Santa Maria was, oh again, this is a actual life-size replica of the Santa Maria. Just really cool. It looks all closed right now. And they got some other stuff going on as well here, but yeah. Oh, kind of neat. Oh. All right. A couple more places to go. Optometrists. Lens crafters. It's another couple of places I go to get glasses from. Ooh. Love boutique if you need to get your freak on. Don't know what this store is like, but they're hurting that they got everything inventory. Oh, it looks like they're getting ready to close. Smartphone repair place. Mobile clinic. Hat store with a few jerseys. You can rep your team or whatever. Tattoo shop. Compete with a Harley in it. That's kind of neat. Bunch of piercings, other stuff. Reminds me I need to get some more work on. Done. Oh, would it be okay if I did some quick video in here? Okay, no problem. Hey, so much for that idea. Oh well, it's your local uh, head shop. Get all your pipes and other fun stuff there. Is it Bead World or something? No. Bead in the interesting play on words. Oops, if I can get my camera to turn the right way. All kinds of fun stuff there, I guess. No. Oh, this way. There you go. This is the other side of that hall I was just at. It's 
uh, another tattoo bar place. Little bingo hall. How about that? Dental center. There used to be a rock hound store down here. I think it was right where those billboards are. That's kind of upsetting. Oh. You want to get your uh, your wine on or your spirit on? Another good spot. Okay, but on that note, since we're close to an entrance here and I really want to smoke, we're gonna tune or uh, end this one. So this is the end of number three. Oops, I can never get my gimbal to work right here or do what I want it to. It's not that it doesn't work right, I just don't know how to use it. Okay, so this is the end of number three. I want to smoke. So we're going to get back to that and I'll get back to you guys for part four. Okay.